Today I'm going to show you how to use the personal microderm and it is a at home microderm abrasion. You just simply do it at home and it will save you a lot of money. It was pretty easy to use. I started before I took the video so that way I would know what I was doing. And so you're pretty much going to start with a clean dry face and depending on your skin type you're going to use that size head and the coarse or thickness of the head depends on your skin type also. Um, I have pretty tough skin so but I'm still using the smaller one because it's my first time. And they have a larger disc, which I will show you later, which is used for your body also. So I'm going to show you how to do this. But when you do it, you're going to pull the skin up and put it up. Don't stay in one place too long. Always keep it moving. If not, that's how you get scabs. And you never want to go above the cheekbone or below the eyebrow. And I went around here a little bit, but I don't know if you're supposed to, but I do get acne there, as you can see, and I did around my nose and on my nose, so I'm going to show you how to use that now. You can hear the vacuum sucking some places it doesn't get it, but you've got to keep moving because that disc is still on your face. And the white stuff is the skin that it's taking off. So you can tell where you've already passed through. You want to move in an upwards motion. And once you're finished, you can kind of see the white on my face. That's your dead skin cells. So once you're done doing that, you'll want to wash your face and dry it and apply the serum and then clean your utensil really well. And when I come back, I will show you the serum and the discs. Okay, so you're going to have three discs. And there's a green one, which is a finer grit. And once you start doing it more, you'll be able to use it more on your, on your whole body. Then you'll have a smaller green fine grit. And this one will be able to go on your face. After you, you've been using the blue one for a while, then here's the blue one, which is the one you'll start off with first. And this one is the bigger one, and this is the one that will go on your body. Elbows, uh, decollete, legs, whatever. And then here is the blue disc, the smaller one, and this is the one that I used on my face. 
and you will get two of the vacuum cups and this one is bigger as you can see and this one is for the big fine grit disc and when you put it on your machine it will go in there and this one is for the smaller one and it will go in here so when you place it on your machine whether it's the big one or the little one you'll just place it on top and then you'll place your vacuum cup on the top and you'll just screw it on and it's on and when you plug it in you'll set it inside and push it in and do a quarter of a turn and then you plug it in and you're ready to go when you're finished with your my your personal microderm you're going to unscrew it and take off your your cap and you're going to rinse out each of these suction cups and you won't get this part wet at all then you will take out this black piece some of them are black some of them are clear but you will take this out and put it in between your thumb and your fingers and rub it underneath the water and that will get rid of all of the hair or excuse me not the hair the dead skin cells that you had on your face and once you're done doing the whole microderm on your face you will then take the skin recovery moisturizer and place it on your face and I suggest that if you're going to be going outside anytime not just when you do the microderm but anytime that you go outside you should always be putting on an SPF um, so this was my first time doing it and you're only supposed to do it once a month so I can already see a big improvement in my skin. It's soft. It feels really great. Um, there's one spot that I did, I think that I got too much, and it got a little red right here, but I shouldn't have any scabbing. I mean, it just burns a little bit, but it should be all right. I'm pretty excited because my skin feels really great. It's nice and smooth and I don't know, I just can't wait to give it a try again and see how much more my skin improves and looks a lot better. So um, that's my review for the, micro, the personal microderm.